load for fuck's sake. There we go. Oh, not again. Alright, so I finally started doing this again, and I just realized that the last character I was on was my badass Jesus character rather than Soup. So yeah, we get to sit through a fucking loading screen to start another loading screen. Load you fucker! Please? Please? Do it. Do it! Oh yeah, and uh... Eh. Mark, I made your house in Minecraft. Um, you didn't... Yep, there we go. You didn't specify on uh, what, like, furnishings you wanted, so I just added two tables, three chairs, and uh, a workbench, jukebox, and crafting table. Oh, and pistons for tables at the, in the lower bit, and an alchemy table. Okay, keep in mind that uh, on this, since I accidentally chose my badass Jesus character, why is he wearing a helmet? Whatever. On this character, it was a skeever who spawned here. Load. Load soup. Actually, if you looked at the, uh, that uh, little picture, it actually shows what fucking attacked me as this character. Wow. Really? I'm exactly 11 levels higher? So... Soup is higher level than badass Jesus. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck are you attacking me on this character? Does that look familiar? Alright, the reason we're going here is so, uh... I'm holding on eating Reese's. Alright. The hell? I thought I heard footsteps. Anyway. Yeah. The reason we're going here is so as we can start a, uh, a quest. Okay. So we can start a quest, of course. Just now. Yeah, we can start a quest for the uh, the Ethereum shards. You may have gone into random uh, dwarven ruins and found an item called an Ethereum shard. There's four of them, and one of them is here. And this is the place where you learn that you have to collect them. Thank you, motorcycle. So anyway, okay, wait a minute, why is it that every time I start fucking recording, everybody comes back, just as I started, just as I fucking loaded soup, guess who got home? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, we... Oh, we have our uh, crossbow. And now I don't want to talk because they're home. Thank you. 
Oh yeah, that's how you start the quest, by the way. Finding and reading a book called The Ethereum Wars. Sometimes it for some reason doesn't start the quest, though. Thanks on the Xbox version. I don't even mean to look away. Here we're also going to be encountering an enemy we haven't seen for a while. <sighs> if it, let's see, it's Dwarven Ruins, and there's uh, Titan Walls over there. So I'll give you two guesses. I'll give you a hint. They used to be Snow Elves. Ooh, Macalite. I can't roll as bad as Jesus. I keep forgetting that I can roll on this character. Yeah, yeah, that was quite a fall. Alright, keep in mind that this book actually gives you hints as to how to, uh, as to where to find the other three Ethereum shards, and how to, uh, how to open the gate at the end of this dungeon. See? Yeah, I accidentally found like four of them. Oh wait, I'll continue reading because it shows the, uh, well, some of the combination. That will come in handy later. Also, yes, I see the Centaurian, uh, gyro and ingots down there, but I don't want it. Come on, come on, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, squish! Wait, it didn't see me until I uncrouched. And now it doesn't see anything. Ooh. Creepy. Oil. Wait, have I seriously not taken oil? <sighs> Ingredients. Oh, I haven't. Gives us weakness to magic, yay. If I remember right, there's not many enemies for a while. Also, that way goes nowhere. At least I don't think. Used to go somewhere. <sighs> Sad view doesn't now. Wish I could have gone down there. Come on. Come on. Get over here, you retard. Where is she? Too late. She know that? Where is the there is? I need to name this thing at some point. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> 